Catherine Grocher. Hello. <laughs> Jasmine um, is, hold on, I'm trying to make sure we're live in the team page. There we go. All right, I see us. We're good. Um, so Jasmine, I am blessed. There we go. Let me turn the sound down. Okay, so I am super blessed um, to have Jasmine as my front line. And um, gosh, over the time that she's been with us, we've really grown to be friends and we have so much in common. And I just, I just adore this girl. And she has wonderful energy and passion. And I'm super duper pumped for y'all to learn from her tonight. It's going to be good. It's going to be real good. Um, so let's see. Who do we have on? We have Debbie on. We have Jessica on. Hey, girls. And Jasmine, if you want to. So on your screen, this is the first time I'm doing this with Be Live TV. Are you able to see the comments and stuff on your screen as well? Yes, I see Tanya is here. Jose. Eight people watching live. Awesome. Yeah, so... Um, on your phone is the only place you're going to be able to see like who joins if they don't comment. So if you want that, you can open that up on your phone. Um, but you know, you don't have to, cause if they comment, you'll be able to see their comments here. Perfect. So let's see. So we have a lot of people hopping on Debbie, Jessica, Lori, Jessica Ortiz, Casale. You need to teach me if I'm saying your name, last name, right? Since savvy, Laura Meeks, Michelle Sullivan, Courtney Malden. Look at all you guys. Love it. Hi, Raquel. Love seeing you guys hop on. Okay, so um, before I pass it over to Jasmine, I just kind of want to talk with y'all about some news. So let's see. There we go. All right. So one thing that I want to say is – the importance of marking your calendar for all of our team events. So at the start of every single month, our cover photo, so the image at the very top of this Facebook page that you're on right now, that is our cover photo. So every single month at the start of the month, I create a new cover photo image that has all of the dates of all of our connection opportunities. What do I mean by connection opportunities? I mean this, like opportunities for you to connect with your Cincy sisters and brothers and grow and learn together um, and just bond. And uh, it's, it's really a wonderful opportunity for you to grow personally and professionally. Trust me. Every time I participate in something, I grow. Right, Jasmine? Absolutely. Yeah. So that is an easy way for you to stay in the know of what's going on. So definitely make sure to take note of that. Our live Thursdays are every other Thursday. So you can literally sit down right now, pull out your planner and mark down every single live Thursday training for the end till the end of the year. It's every other Thursday. So tonight we have one. So we're going to be off next Thursday and then we'll have one the following super easy to follow along. Um, I also want to encourage you as a consultant, like one of the things you should be doing every single day to like, open your door for business and say, hello, I'm here. I'm a Sensi consultant is log into your workstation. Like that's our, that's our, you know, home base. You know, it's really, really important. And it's super important that you check your news tab. That news tab is updated constantly, like very, very often with really helpful information that you need to know as a consultant, like you need to know what's possibly on back order. You need to know when there's a new buddy coming out. You need to know when reunion registration opens and things like that. And you're going to know those things by going to your news tab. And it just takes just a few minutes each day, but get into the habit of doing that. So I also want to talk about reunion really, really quick. Um, Jasmine's been to reunion. Yes, I haven't yes. missed one. Yeah. What do you want to say about reunion? Well, I mean, if you are serious about your business or even if you're a serious hobbyist, reunion is, is the place to be, you know, not only because you get the best trainings, not only because you get all these amazing freebies. I mean, remember when we got the diffuser in our kit? That's one hundred and thirty dollars and it came with the shade. Um, we got all kinds of samples for the oils and the cleaning products, but more importantly, it's the relationships that you build. It's oh, yeah. lifelong relationships because from that you find your tribe and then you're able to build upon each other and support each other, celebrate each other. And it's just an unbelievable experience. 
So I would definitely recommend it. I know you definitely recommend it. It's not even a recommendation. You just got to do it. That's what we do on whatever team you're on. That's just what we do as Sensi Consultants. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And we always say when you show up, you go up like and it's it really is true. And show up doesn't just mean reunion. Uh, show up means stuff like this. So congratulations to the 22 of you that are on here live watching right now. Like, Yay. yeah, you're showing up. What's going to happen? You're going to go up, right? Absolutely. <laughs> so um, reunion registration is going to be opening soon. I posted something here in our team page talking about it. You, There are so many ways to cut costs to go to reunion. There's a payment plan yeah. to help you. I, I do the payment plan every single year just because. I mean, why not, right? You don't have to pay extra and you just pay a little at a time. It's the way to go, man. Yeah. So do the payment plan. And then when it comes to your flights, you have plenty of time to like look and try to find your ideal flight or drive or whatever is going to be more cost effective for you. And then for rooming room with three other people that really will cut down on your cost of your hotel stay. And I am going to create when registration opens, I'm going to create a Facebook event within our team page for everyone going to reunion. So, and within that event, I will also have a, a place for people who are looking for roommates to find other roommates and stuff. So you can room with people from our, our family of teams and, and all that great stuff. But you don't want to miss it. I mean, there's so many fun things like our lanyards with our ribbons. And oh. I mean, y'all, it's it's awesome. I'm trying to find my Sunshine State Superstars ribbons. I thought they were right here, but they're not. But anyway, there are just so many fun little extras and um, it's just an amazing thing. So um, I, what'd you say? You said the free concert and entertainment. Oh, yeah. The entertainment's phenomenal. It's absolutely it's always top notch. Like, OK, so we've had. Uh, let's see. Who did we have last year, Jasmine? Uh, was it Parachute? Yeah, we had Parachute last year. Um, and then we had um, the people, we, we went to the Grand Ole Opry. Yeah. And we, at the Grand Ole Opry, we had, um, what is her name? She sings that song, Road Less Traveled. I can't think of her name right now. All, all I know, she was amazing. Kelsey Ballerini. No, that's the yeah. girl who sings Peter Pan. I can't think of her name. Someone tell me. Um, who was it? Does Jose know? <laughs> Oh, Lauren Elena, Scotty yeah. McCreary. Yeah, we had a ton of people at the actual Grand Ole Opry. It was so cool. And then the year before that, we had uh, One Republic. Yes, One and Republic was amazing. We've had, um, oh my gosh, we've had Kelly Clarkson. We've had Clint Black and Gloriana. We had, um, oh my gosh, we just had amazing bands, amazing bands. I'm, not I'm forgetting tons by any means. I mean, they are a listers, B listers. They're up there. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. yeah. So anyway, you gotta, gotta do it. It's worth it. It's a good ladies trip. It's all a tax write off. Every single dollar you spend is a tax write off, you know, and starts. tax write off. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. So, um, those are the little news plugs that I wanted to give you tonight, but now I'm going to pass things over to Jasmine and Jasmine. I have to just brag on her for a second. Um, cause that's just what I do. Right. I mean, y'all are amazing. I love to brag on you. Um, so Jasmine is a superstar consultant. So does anyone know what that means? That means that Jasmine has climbed up a lot, right? We started essential. Then we go to certified. Then we go to lead. Then we go to star. Then we go to superstar. So that's a big deal. That's a big deal. If you're a superstar right now, you're a big deal. That's a big deal. It's one step to director. All right, so Jasmine has a team of 19 people. Yeah, 19. That's awesome. Awesome. <laughs> um, and Jasmine has been, let's see, when did you join? You joined in August of 2014. So two years. Ah, I love it. Yeah. Two years. This will be your third year this August. Flies so fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Jasmine is Jasmine is seriously one of the most sweet, kind hearted, giving people. Um, and she's expecting right now, too, which is so exciting. <laughs> you can't see it right now, but <laughs> he's hanging out with us. Mm -hmm. So um, without further ado, I'm going to pass things over to my wonderful friend, Jasmine, and she's going to share her great training she has with you guys. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning in. I have 25 
hot tips for you and hot stands for hands on training so i'm glad that you guys have jumped on let me get back to this i'm seeing different people write down so all right so if you haven't already grab your notepads i'm gonna go pretty quickly so that i can get through everything and hopefully have enough time at the end to have some q a so, They're saying stand up. They want to see your cute little belly. <laughs> they want to see the belly, Jasmine. Let me see. Ah, here it is. Look at the belly. Aww. Come on. <laughs> She's 20 weeks, guys. 20 weeks. <laughs> Y'all are so sweet. Thank you very much for all the congratulations. This is why I love Sensi. I mean, we're here doing a training, and here you guys are congratulating me on my first child to be. So thank you very much. I appreciate it. So number one, sharing is caring. So Katie's going to go ahead and put on the tips so that you guys can write it down. So what you guys need to do to rock this catalog season is to start sharing it with everyone not selling it we don't want to be annoying salespeople here here we want to make sure that we share it so start asking realtors start asking apartment complexes doctors dentist offices salons small mom and pop businesses friends of friends your friends family whoever you know ask them if you can leave just some catalogs or if they could pass out some samples for you and be a sample fairy or even put a raffle box in their office or even have a loaner program so that they can borrow a warmer and have some of your business cards in their office because believe me when people walk in and they smell sensi they're going to ask about it so make sure that you ask 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 I remember a consultant who actually shared at a construction site and she went around to each construction site with room sprays and offered to let them borrow it. Eventually, everybody at the construction site wanted the room spray because they wanted to freshen up their stinky little cranes when they were sitting in all day long. So just don't limit yourself. Make sure that you just Think about all the different options that you have available to you. And don't limit yourself to being local. Sometimes we think that we just have to stay where we are in our zip code. So I live here in Miami. I don't have to just limit myself to Miami. You can expand nationwide. And then you also want to go international as well. So number two, next one, create clubs. Put on your creativity cap. Think about what clubs you can create to promote sales, but in a subtle way. For example, if you partner up with a dentist's office, you can actually help encourage good checkoffs or good checkups by having a no cavity club. So you can have a raffle box and then enter in everybody who doesn't have a cavity when they go to the dentist's office and then raffle off an item. So if it's for kids, you can raffle off a Sensi body or if it's an adult, you can raffle off maybe a nightlight or a warmer or something within your budget. But you don't have to spend the money for it. If you are hustling and making sure that you have your party set up, you're going to have host rewards. So you can actually get those items for free or have price as the prizes. You can make cute certificates. You can also do something similar for kids getting good grades at a tutoring center, a nursing home, or a car dealership. The car dealership, you have car bars and scent circles. But what is priceless here is the fact that you have a raffle box and you're getting contact information that you can enter into your workstation and follow up with everybody. So just be creative with that. You don't want to give anything for free. There always needs to be some kind of strategic point that you're going with and follow up is one of those things. So next one is number three have a loaner program. I kind of touched upon that a little bit with the offices, but basically you can have a borrow bag and this is what my little borrow bag looks like. So I have you clip on here and then of course I wrote my website at the top and then inside of here I have like a night light and I'm going to have like a tabletop based 
You can also have um, just different things that people don't know that you usually sell. People know that we sell warmers and wax, but then they don't know that we also have whip body souffle. So I will put this in the bag and then I wrote on the top, try me. And then I put oh. with the page number on the top of it. So imagine this going to an office, smart. trying this, they're going to fall in love with it. Jasmine, um, that's so smart. Thank you. <laughs> I love that you just wrote on the, I, I would have never even thought to do that. Look at that. Try me, the counter clean. This isn't even a full bottle. You know, I just put whatever I have, whatever you have available, you know, so this one is like about a quarter full and they can use it to clean their desk or, you know, this is a magic eraser in a bottle, but it's also $10. And so that's equivalent to two wax bars. So this is going to go a little bit quicker when they use it in the kitchen, on the office, on the walls and things like that. So it's a good consumable product. So anyways, it gives people the chance to try it, especially if they're not familiar with it. And if you want to boost sales, then focus on things such as the laundry love package and create a program around it. So you can actually have a loaner program of the laundry products and have the laundry liquid, the washer whisks, the um, Scentsy Soft. You can also have the dryer disc in there and let them borrow it for a week and write a review. And maybe that gets entered into a raffle that they can get something else. Um, you can even partner my my home girl, my team, Raquel, uh, her husband does Uber. And so she gives him product lists and also the Sensi spray in a car bar. So he sprays the car before people go into it. And then when they ask about it, he gives them the product list and says, hey, make sure you put in a good word for me because I get freebies if you mention me. And it's just a good little turnaround. Isn't that smart? So the next one is the 5010. I know that you've heard Katie talk about it as well as other teamies um, and other directors. But basically, it's making 50 samples the month before and 10 join packets. Why do I say the month before? Because if you enroll in the scent of the month program or the warmer of the month program, then you are making samples of that fragrance that is going to be released the next month. So we have our April scent of the month that is going to be coming out soon. We we've had it since what? When do we have our April package, Katie? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Like, I remember now, right? <laughs> it feels like it's been like a month and a half. So we've had it for a while. Well, you should have 50 samples of the April scent of the month as well as 10 possibility packets. So our business works on a 90 day cycle. You won't always see immediate results. It's just like going to the gym. If you go to the gym one time, you're not going to see any results. It's like humanly impossible. But if you're consistent with it, you're going to eventually see it. So it works on a 90 day cycle. You want to break it down into daily, weekly, monthly and quarterly goals. And then you kind of want to make sure that you follow that cycle. It's very repetitious. And then you will see results. For example, I have a calendar of what samples I'm going to make each month. So like this month, I'm focusing on counter clean. Next month, I'll focus on the whip body souffle. The next month after that, I'll focus on the body wash. And then I make samples in addition to the scent of the month. And I put it all together. So um, let's see, you can pass it out while running errands, while at, at events, when you go to a concert, at the fast food window, wherever you go, just pass it out. But first try to engage in some sort of conversation and banter. Then you don't come off kind of weird. <laughs> I know it's always hard to kind of push yourself out there, but definitely engage in some conversation. How many times do you stand in a grocery line and end up talking to somebody? And then just let them know, I really enjoyed our conversation. I hope you enjoyed this, this gift. They're gonna look at it, they're gonna read it. And if they're really interested, they'll follow up with you. So this is what um, my possibility packet looks like. 
if I am to give it out like in person. So I personalize it with like a little label that I can write their name on it. And then I have my little story card because Katie taught me so well. So oh, that the pirate pirate. Pirate. Can you see it? There you there go. go. So this is like my story card. I have pictures from reunion on there. And then I went into my story, how I got started, why they would probably like it as well. In our team files, there's a list of top reasons as to why to join. And you can customize this to your liking. Change it up as you want. Depending on if I'm mailing this or not, I will either put a felt sample like this so that it doesn't, you know, melt, but they can still smell it. Or I'll actually use one of my wax molds and put that in instead. Blue Grotto, that's gold. Oh my gosh, right? That is gold. Oh, it smells so good. <laughs> fruity pebbles. You know, I did a post talking about authenticity. I did a post and I said, oh, fruity pebbles, it smells so great. I immediately got a phone call from someone who said, why were you holding out on me? How could I not know about my house smelling like a cereal without milk? I was like, it's Blue Grotto. <laughs> so then I also went ahead and did a scent circle. I also have a cute little bookmark in here. Of course, I have the catalog. But you personalize it with what you have on hand. You know, you don't have to do anything fancy. I put something like this in my handbag, which is just the little plastic baggies for, you know, mailers out of the Scentsy Family Store. And then I have my story in here. I have a join brochure. But then I like to put things that are not always Scentsy related to personalize it. So I have a nice little magnet that I made and it just has like a quote. I did like 20 on a page, laminated, cut it out put a magnet on it, and then I also have like a little sample of lotion. So you can keep it simple. Um, doo -doo -doo. I'm making sure I go through everything. Number five, next one. Thank you, Jessica, I'm glad you like it. Okay, sample goodie packs. So I started talking a little bit about samples and sample making, but it's important to try to make them seasonal because the longer you're in the game, I like to say in the game, since the game, um, people are going to get accustomed to things that you're doing and they're going to look forward to it. So if you make them seasonal, for example, I use little Easter eggs around this time and everybody who is my customer knows that it's about that time for the search of the golden ticket. And one of these eggs are going to have a golden ticket and that golden ticket will be free product. And then this one, you open it up and it's actually just washer whisks. So instead of just having the baggie by itself, I actually put the washer whisks in the cute little egg. It just makes it like fun and exciting. Who doesn't like to play with new things and see different things? I also have pink rabbits this year. And when you open up the rabbit, <laughs> I know, right? A pink rabbit. <laughs> it's actually just one of the count of clean samples. And then it has the information about white tea and cactus right there inside of the rabbit. So it just makes it fun. Um, three layer samples. We've heard about this. They'll need to buy at least a three pack if you do a three layered sample. So that's just smart marketing. Um, you can also, that's on page 13, actually, in our fabulous catalog. They give you a scent recipe already. Um, you can even Facebook search, you know, scent recipes, Scentsy, and things like that. And it'll give you more ideas. So number six, next one, be a memory maker. If you see me keep looking to the side, it's because I'm trying to make sure I don't run out of time. <laughs> so be a memory maker. All right, scents have a unique ability to trigger vivid memories. So we need to use this to our advantage, especially for new homeowners, um, even people who are new apartment owners or condo association owners, but also those people who specialize in that field because you can ask them, and I challenge you guys to do that for the spring and summer catalog, ask them if you can put in their clubhouse Model homes, apartment units, 
a warmer or a nightlight. Imagine having baked apple pie in the kitchen or fresh lavender and satin sheets in the bedroom. That's sure to help close some deals for them and it's a mutually beneficial relationship. Ask if they would like to also use them as closing gifts. The possibilities are endless. Number seven, smell and eat. All right, you wanna bring these babies, your mini testers, wherever you go. When you go out to eat, when you grab coffee, when you get together with your friends, make sure that you bring them with you. I literally take the bag that it comes in. I don't even make it fancy anymore. I just bring this in my handbag because I know, because I brand myself, someone's gonna ask me, how am I doing in my business? And I'm gonna tell them, all the great things is happening, that I just earned a trip to Punta Cana, that I can't wait to go on my baby moon. And by the way, everyone's going crazy over the new spring summer scents. And then boom, take it out and share it. I swear, they are going to love it. And it's just an easy way for you guys to have fun because impromptu parties are usually the best kind of parties. But that's why it's very, very, very important for you to be loyal to one brand rather than dating several different companies because people are going to get confused. I have a friend on my timeline that is a direct sales consultant for probably about eight different companies. And for a long period of time, she won't post anything about Sensi. And I'm like, oh, is she a consultant with Sensi still? And then all of a sudden, boom, she'll post up the Sensi. But you want people, when they think of you, to think of Sensi and then refer you as their Sensi girl. So then they will refer you to other people. So that leads me to number eight. Create a referral program. If you want to increase your business, if you want to increase sales, if you want to increase your likelihood of having your team grow, and I know you heard probably Katie mention before about my story, living in Miami, I, I got frustrated. You know, um, we're a very busy city. And I talked to, you know, a couple of my other Miami girls down here. We actually have team members all over. Now we do. <laughs> uh, Texas, North Carolina, South Carolina, Ohio, the list goes on. Maryland. Um, I know I'm missing a lot. But what happened was that I stopped just focusing in on my city and expanded. And the way that I did that was through a referral program. So you can actually use a free set circle for every person that they refer and if they order that's something really simple you can make a sticker and put it on the front of every catalog in terms of looking for international referrals so you can say you're looking for germany or spain or you know ireland canada uh, maybe the specific states that you're looking for you know you can personalize the sticker however you want just don't limit yourself don't assume You'll be surprised who knows who because of six degrees of separation. You can even use referral punch cards that we have from the Sensi Family Store, which is really cool because it has your business information on the back and then they're responsible for turning that in so that they can get a free wax bar. Another easy way to get referrals is when people post about how happy they are. I decided to use the same graphic that Katie used on her big postcards that Stephanie Melbourne used or created. And I put it on business cards instead so that I could get a lot more and put it in. Yeah, I put my contact info on the back too. And so then I put that in with my sample goodie bags. So number nine, open for business. Always make it official. One way that you can make it official is that when you're meeting with customers or teenies or potentials in a public place, you want to turn your sign to open. And one way of doing that is by putting at the end of a table a little paper that says meeting in progress, or you can get one of the little buttons from the Sensi Family Store. And remember, every time we buy products from the Family Store, they invest all that money that we spent 
back into us so that we can do fun events and recognitions and things like that. So it's a win-win. But it's an easy way so that people can see how much fun you're having. At the very least, put catalogs at the end of your table because when people walk by and they see that you guys are doing something, it's going to pique their curiosity. But don't just give out your catalogs for free. Make sure that you have them fill out the information. It has washi tape at the top. So then I can keep the information, they can keep the catalog, and then you can follow up. There is fortune in the follow up. You can even put a buddy at the end of the table, whatever you want to do. But it's going to pique their curiosity and it's going to lead to more customers and more potentials. Number 10, update your contacts once a month. So you want to make sure that you enter your new contacts. So if it's from a raffle form or, you know, if they found you using the consultant locator, new orders, etc., go through all of the contacts and make sure that you check off newsletter. Because if you don't have that box checked off, they will not get your newsletter. And that's just an easy branding tool that Sensi is so generous to give us with our PWS. So it keeps them up to date with Sensi World with the newsletter, but also try to take time to personalize your newsletter so that it sounds like it's coming from you and your, your customers buy from you. There's a lot of different Sensi consultants in their area, or maybe they know a lot of different consultants. Even if you are the only consultant in their area, they have options, they have choices. And the reason why they choose to shop with you is because of your personality and things that make you unique. So make sure that you try to update your newsletter by the last of each month. Number 11, be a personal shopper. You wanna pay attention to what people like and offer it. If they like unicorns, suggest the Enchant Diffuser or the Unicorn Buddy Clip. If they love Country Chic, suggest Live Simply or the Fruit Crate. You wanna also upsell. Focus on your combined and sells. Don't start with, you know, oh, how much is um, one wax bar? And you're like, $5. No, start with buy five, get one free, because people are going to hear the word free, and they're going to want to buy it. But when you pay attention to detail to what people like, it makes them feel special. They know that you remember them, and they will want to buy from you. But there's a difference between saying, hey, I know how much you love unicorns, and then telling them about the buddy clip or, oh my God, you need this in your life, it costs X amount of dollars. So don't be that annoying salesperson. Make sure that you are sharing, not selling. Number 12, one bag home parties. This catalog season, keep it fun, keep it fresh, keep it festa. One bag home parties allow you to show how easy it is to party while also showing how easy it is to be a consultant with a little hustle and heart. So choose one light bulb warmer, one element, a mini warmer, a diffuser, testers, catalogs, a Scentsy pen or a couple Scentsy pens because that makes you look professional. The empty love container or laundry love containers, you can have an empty washer with, box container, the empty liquid, the empty um, softener because they can still smell it, but it's a lot lighter for you to carry. And then you can also gift the counter clean because when they take out the counter clean as a gift or even the kitchen detergent, then you can talk about it and say, oh, did you know that this is the new clean and line? It's amazing. Number 13. Oh, let me go back. Sorry. Turn up, it's going to turn down. <laughs> <laughs> With the one bag home parties, you can also use the product list and have them use it as a wish list and have them circle everything. And they can even put stars next to their favorite fragrances and stuff like that. But this actually makes it really easy for you to book parties without forcing a party or trying to convince them to party because all you have to say is, oh my goodness, you love Scentsy as much as I do. Why not host a party and we can get the rest of your list 
for free and half price. So I love that idea. And um, I learned that from Christina Steenberg. So 13, turn up. <laughs> have fun party themes. Okay, this will be rapid fire. This spring and summer, you can have a spring fling brunch, a tea party, and feature southern sweet tea wax hot or cold tea, a do-it-yourself tea bar with fruits and things. You can wear hats. You can have pigtails and punch. You can have baseball. You can have mugs with root beer, popcorn, and showcase the baseball warmers and or the home run mini warmer. You can have a taco fiesta and feature our mix and match warmer because that's perfect for it. You can have a sorbet party and have samples of pineapple and lemon sorbet. A margarita party, Cinco de Mayo is right around the corner. Who doesn't like margaritas and chips and salsa? You can have a tropical paradise party with Hawaiian shirts and dresses and lays and wax samples. Popsicle party, a guys only party, an open house style for Mother's Day gifts and baskets. Snow cone party, a zen party. You can pre-order and the make a scene warmers with the new Zen garden decorative scene and sit down and do that together with some common music. There's so much we can do. You don't have to party alone. You can actually have your teenies do it with you, have their guests come and join in on the fun because it ain't no fun if the homies can't have none. <laughs> <laughs> Number 14, focus ahead. Don't plan or book a party in April. For April, you want to try to book it at least a month or two in advance. So starting in February, March, you want to make sure that you're booking your parties. Remember, you have Easter. You have Mother's Day. You have Father's Day, birthdays, end of the school year gifts, baby showers. So you can start creating your own uh, different baskets and make a photo app so that you have collages of it. If it's a personal special, then you need to really just message everybody individually so that you can stay in compliance. But come up with something catchy. For example, some bunny to love. You can use Bailey the bunny with the scent pack of choice, enjoy the little things with the mini warmer and jump in jelly bean. Number 15. Create a photo album on your phone. You want an album so that you can put screenshots of potential new teamies. You want an album for people that you see posting different things that they like or if they're going through a difficult time so that you can reach out to them, you can send them a card or just a message, or you can even just follow up with different things and say, oh, I saw, you know, you love owls. The Whoop Warmer is amazing. It makes me think of you. The third album should be of the new warmers and the new scents. Number 16. Sensi is your job. This is your job. As in the words of Sarah Robbins, treat your business like a business, it will pay as a business. But if you treat it as a hobby, it will pay as a hobby. So the choice is yours. Do you want to get paid as a business or do you want to get paid as a hobbyist? So when people ask you, what do you do? Say, I do blank, but my real passion is Sensi. Or I do blank but I also have my own business. And wait for it, they will always ask you, what is your business? And you can share with them a little bit more. Number 17, ditch the consultant lingo. Be authentic, be you. Nobody is better than you than you. So when you have possibility packets, make it fit your personality. If you do pouch parties, I call them smell kits. My customers or friends know that it's a smell kit because guess what? If I say a pouch party, they don't know what that means. But if I say smell kit, they know it involves some sort of smelling. And I mail those and I do that local as well. A basket party, you can call it a party on the go, party in a bag, but some of the consultant lingo that we use with one another, we need to break it down very simple and basic when we're sharing it with other people. Because if not, they get overwhelmed, they get confused, they get turned off. People want things that are easy. Our job is to make it easy for them. Number 18, embrace your inner Hollywood post videos. 
Okay, you see, I'm not perfect. I stumble and bumble like everybody else, but it makes me me and it makes me genuine. So according to Cisco, who is the worldwide leader in IT and networking, Facebook video, Facebook video posts have increased by 94% annually in the United States and will constitute over 80% of all consumer internet traffic by 2020. So if you don't make videos because you're not willing to break out of your comfort zone, guess what? Somebody else is going to take your business because they're going to be willing to get onto Facebook Live or YouTube or whatever videos, and they're going to do it for you. Don't let that happen. So how-to videos is like a really good craze. You can do a how-to do laundry for $1.38 a load, how to change wax, how to create a scent mix, how to make a sample, how to use counter clean, 10 different ways. But keep in mind, I'm guilty of this too. 85% of Facebook videos are viewed without sound. How amazing is that? So you want to make sure that whatever you do, if I catch in, So not a part of it. When I work out, right now I have on my American Hero shirt. I've been branding for like the past couple weeks. And the girls are looking at me. They are seeing my website on the back of my shirt. So it can be a hat, a t-shirt, or even brand with our Sensi car bar. You can actually use the string, take that off, and use it as a beautiful headband. Look at that. Get creative. There are also a business expense, so it's a write-off too. You can put a buddy clip on your handbag, on a stroller, on your car indicator. I've made cells because I had my buddy clip on my indicator. Also, make sure that you change your wax or even add orange strawberry melon oil to your diffuser before you have guests over because guess what? They're going to smell it when they come into your house. When my husband's friends come over, I make sure I do that, and they always leave buying something. Number 20, promo bags. Use our promotion bags for grocery shopping and write your website on it. You can find out more information about our promo bags in the family store, but it's an easy way just to brand. I love how you um, write your website URL. URL. I would have never heard yeah, of that. Yeah, just write it with a Sharpie. I know I'm going over. Am I okay? Okay. okay. So number 21, we're almost done. Put the fun into fundraising. So you can do the infamous post. If you had $500, what charity would you give it to and why? But make sure that you have an engaging photo of you with it or your kids with it. You know, hello, we have our super buddy here. How cute is that? So that you can take Aww. a picture with our super buddy. Have you seen this? It's so cute. I love it. So every person who actually comments on your post, you want to personally reach out to them through Facebook Messenger, text, phone call, and, and offer the opportunity. So for example, if they commented about helping rescue animals, ask if they would like to partner with you and do a I Love Dogs vs. Cats warmer fundraiser. If they said they want to help a children's charity, suggest our super buddy or one of our other limited edition buddies. Our workstation actually gave us an idea about Shriners Children's Hospital and reaching out to them to arrange a fundraiser. So you want to reach out to the coordinator at your local Shriners Children's Hospital. And that was with the workstation, like Katie said earlier. They give us tips. They give us different things that will help our business thrive if we are willing to try it out and implement it. Um, also, on our Sunshine State Superstars team page, in the file section, there's pre-made documents that you can actually edit and use, but your generosity will not only help others in need, but it will also help expand your network with new customers. So in Sensi, we always give more than we take. Number 22, window shopping. We see with our eyes, we see first. So when you walk by a store and it's all bright and glittery and has a little thing that says, oh, free sample if you come inside, well, you're probably going to go inside and take a look. So it's important that we do that when we bag our orders. I used to like to use like bags that had like a 
bunch of designs on the front, but now I just use the bag says Sensi is generous to include because people can see through it. And then I use little cute bags like this to put my wax, but I also put my little sample goodies in here. So I'll write freebies on here. This is obviously from St. Patrick's. And then I also have like for Valentine's and things like that. For the eyes buy, but it also shows that you pay attention to detail. I had a friend tell me today that her friend picked up her order and she didn't want to open it because she said it looked so pretty and it looked like a gift. So it shows that you take time but consider mailing your thank you cards instead of putting your thank you cards in the bag because people get overstimulated they're so excited about the freebies and how pretty it looks and the new product that the thank you card can kind of get pushed to the side but if you mail it out a week or two afterwards then they're going to feel really special they're going to remember you again and it's just a great follow-up to me because let's get real, nobody likes junk mail and nobody likes bills, but we like our snail mail when it makes us feel good. Number 23, and I'm gonna have to plug in my computer because it's gonna die for me. Jasmine, you're killing it. You're getting tons of hearts, tons of comments. I don't know if you're able to see the comments, but people are loving your training. Yay! I'm sorry, I'm like usually so much more but my computer wants to act crazy. It's fine. Like you said, we have to be authentic, right? Right? Exactly. So technical difficulties. There we go. All right. So number 23, dare to be different. How many people saw the same photo of our new Sensi Sloth buddy? Mm -hmm. Everywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everywhere, the same exact photo. I don't care even if you put your website on it. There comes a point that you have to dare to be different because not only will Facebook start to push those posts further and further down in people's timelines, they will actually kind of eliminate it because they feel that it is a attack on their website that robots are put in this picture just all <laughs> did you see the belly again <laughs> tanya's like we get to see the belly again so it's important that you try something different there were a couple of my friends that i saw that they were creative they added their own personality to it one had a picture of a sloth and pizza because she loves pizza that would be caitlin barrier wasn't it <laughs> She's a, it's a, it was so cute. I was like, genius. Uh, another one had like twin sloths and was like, oh, are they cute or not? You know, add your own personality because guess what? People can often imitate, but they can never duplicate you. You need to be you. Add what you love and your personality to it and it's sure to shine through and be successful. So that leads me to number 24. We have two more. Two more tips, the naughty word. Okay, the naughty word in Sensi is join my team. Yes, we shouldn't have to say join my team. If we're doing what we're doing authentically, if we're keeping it real, and if we're sharing all of this amazingness called share uh, Sensi. So you wanna share your success. They'll want that lifestyle too. It's not bragging if you word it right. I posted a couple days ago um, a picture of my shooting star training award because my teeny Monica was a rock star and hit shooting star. And so I posted the train and mentor award. And I said, whatever you do, just make sure your worth is appreciated. And I got like over 50 plus likes on it because I wrote from the heart, but I wasn't bragging, but at the same token, strategically, I was showing them, guess what? You get charms, you get certificates, you get recognized, join Sensi without saying the naughty word. So consistently show your achievements, your lifestyle, welcome new teams, photos of parties, get hosts to tag you, get customers to tag you, promotions, et cetera. If people see that you're having success and your downline is having success too, they'll feel more comfortable to start. That's why posting every three months that you're about to get inactive ain't gonna work. 
because you have single-handedly shown that Sensi is ineffective and it destroys your brand. If you follow the 90-day cycle, then you're never going to have to post that. You're going to see the fruits of your label, uh, labor. Excuse me. Number 25. I'm like doing a little dance. Jasmine, say what 25 is again. I, for some reason, I didn't have it. Be a goal crusher. So you want a goal crush. So we talked a little bit about reunion. I've never had to pay for a reunion. It's not because I earned it through an incentive. It's because I made a written plan and I had my Sensi cash pay for it. It paid for my flight. It paid for my hotel. It paid for the registration. It paid for meals. All because I had a plan. So make a written plan for this spring summer. What do you want to achieve each month? How much PRV do you need to sell? Remember, those who are willing to show <laughs> those who show up truly do go up. So words cannot express how amazing reunion is. We talked about how amazing it is. So you want to look at the compensation plan. Do you need to promote to increase your commission? Do you want to be in the consultant locator so that can boost your sales as well? You have to be a lead, or lead consultant or higher. So see what you need to do to achieve that. Look at the PRV so that you can end up having great commission checks between now and reunion. Katie already let you know you can have a payment plan so your commission money can go towards your reunion. So chase your dreams. Our next incentive period will be coming up soon. And I really hope that these 25 hot tips, hands on training, will give you a head start, not only with our upcoming incentive that they haven't announced, but with rocking the spring summer catalog, getting you guys promoted. You know, just keep in mind that all flowers have to grow through dirt meaning that you have to put in the work. You got to be willing to have some failures per se. You know, no is not necessarily a bad thing. It's just no for right now. Those people who are not believers in 90 days may come around and they will start believing. It's happened to the best of us. So invest in yourself. You're worth it. Let's make this catalog season record breaking and be prepared to bloom. So I hope you enjoyed everything. Oh, wasn't that amazing? Jasmine, that was so good. This was Jasmine's first so fast. for our group. Didn't she do an awesome job? Why, thank you. Internet ah, class, because I don't want the microphone to be like crazy loud. God, I, I, I don't like doing this stuff. This pushes me out of my comfort zone too. You seemed like a natural. You really, really, it was, it, you were a natural. Um, yeah. And I, I have to say, and that's what it says here on the screen, go give this training life because, you know, I know that you guys appreciate just as much as I do. Jasmine taking her time and sharing these ideas. I mean, you know, she had notes. She took the time to not only do this training right now and spend an hour of her time, but look at all the notes she took, right? She invested time in every single one of you. Why? Because she cares, right? So if you don't take anything from this training and then like act it out then it was for naught right so you are the most important piece here you are going to breathe life into this training you are going to um make this part of your life so that is your way that you can give back to jasmine for giving of her time right so give this training life apply it to your daily life it looks like she's frozen right now um I don't think I'm frozen. I'm not getting comments. Hopefully um, things are okay. Um, it looks like maybe just Jasmine's frozen, but I just want to encourage you. This was phenomenal content. I hope you took notes. Um, go back um, and rewatch it if you missed it. It was really, really good. So much tangible stuff for you to start applying right now. Um, and absolutely um, tag your team members, encourage them to watch this. The playback is going to be available right here on our team page. So um, definitely uh, tag your teamies and encourage them to watch it. And thanks for hanging out for this week's live Thursday. Be back to join us next month 
Um, our next trainings are going to be, let me pull up my calendar so I tell you the dates correctly. Um, oh no, don't do this to me. Give me the month. Okay. So our next trainings are going, the, the next live Thursday is going to be April, April 6th, Thursday, April 6th at 9 p.m. Eastern time. And then again on Thursday, April 20th at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we're going to be talking all about social media next next month and how to kill it on social media with your VIP pages, your business pages, um, how to use cool things like what we are using now for our monthly live trainings, this BeLive.tv that's completely free and so cool. Um, so anyway, it's going to be a phenomenal training, um, phenomenal trainings next month. We want you there. Um, so definitely, um, come and hang out with us and I hope you have a wonderful night and I'm so proud of you for investing time. I'm so proud of you for investing time to be here with us tonight. So thank you to Jasmine and everybody for hanging out and, uh, we'll see you guys next time. Good night, superstars. <laughs>